Hey guys, we're here for another Smash Unbox, okay? And we're going to talk about our Asus laptop, particularly about BIOS update, okay? To be honest with you, this is the first time that I will do a BIOS update on my GT laptop, so I'm kind of worried about it. If I'm not able to post this, then it means that, you know, my laptop is a brick or it doesn't work anymore. Just a disclaimer, guys, uh, this is my go-through experience and you should really be careful updating your bios okay so we'll see if uh, my my bias update will be successful or not okay so please stay tuned Alright guys, what we're going to do is uh, let's go ahead with our My Asus application. Okay, so you search for that, you click on it, and then this will uh, launch this blue window, which is for our Asus. Uh, from here, we need to go to New Updates. You see that on the right side, New Updates. And then let's go to BIOS and Firmware uh, tab. Okay, now let's stay put here for a while, okay? I need to explain something. So there's two ways to actually BIOS update based on this My Asus application. One is the first one, BIOS for Asus Easy Flash Utility. And the other one below, which is BIOS Installer for Windows. Okay. Now, I'm more comfortable doing the BIOS Installer for Windows. So that's what I'm going to download versus the Easy Flash. Okay. Fast forward. Once you download the file, it will give you an, uh, an EXE or an EXE file. So you need to install it, okay? So let's install it from here, accept the agreement. Next, just make sure you know where you actually uh, place the uh, the path of the installed application or the BIOS update, okay? So from here, we have to make sure that uh, nothing is running in the background. So we'll do install. And guys, it prompts me to restart, okay? Make sure your AC adapter is connected, okay? So let's do a restart right now, finish. Restarting again, make sure your AC adapter is connected. Power is very important in this case. Okay, uninterrupted power. Now, after restart, oh my god, it brought me straight to the BIOS. You see that BIOS Asus BIOS update, and it wants me to click on yes or no. So we'll proceed. Let's press on next. BIOS upgrade is processing. Don't turn off your computer sorry guys you know I'm, I'm using the camera i'm holding it at the same time while i'm doing this i'm kind of anxious on you know what will be the result so asus ec flash utility but this is the windows guys remember that this is the windows methodology to update your bios okay so we're getting halfway there uh-huh okay fx505 gt a uh, bit of the version and the date of uh, the trial uh, bias update okay so again make sure that your ac adapter is plugged your power uh, your battery is at least 60 percent or you know 99 percent uh, fully charged because anything that will be around power interruption while you're doing this would likely cause issues with your laptop so please be careful with that okay so we're about 75% there, okay? I don't know what's going to happen once it's reached the 100% uh, of the bar, right? I suppose it might restart again, but uh, we'll actually find out from here. A couple of more seconds, guys. So again, don't turn off your computer, okay? That's, that's a huge warning there. All right, we're almost there, about 98%. And I'm wondering what happens after we're done with the BIOS uh, upgrade. Okay. Whew. That's why, you know, guys, as much as possible, have this done on the uh, uh, repair shop or go to the place where you bought it. Probably they, they, they have more scale or experience doing BIOS update on so many laptops. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, guys, it just turned off my laptop. Okay. I don't know what's going to happen here. But uh, we'll just we'll just monitor it from here, okay? Uh, uh, okay. The keyboard light is on, guys. The keyboard light is on, so take note of that. The LED indicator on the upper right hand side, 
is uh, powered. All right. Okay. Good. This is a good sign. Asus. All right. Uh, that that's kind of fast. Oh, the keyboard light is off. Okay. Okay. Probably still processing the BIOS update. Asus in, uh, in search of incredible. Oh. Okay. Let's see what happens here. Okay. Some readings on the LED. My keyboard is still up. This is a very good sign. Okay. Very good sign. I suppose this should go to the desktop. And that would signify that you have completed your BIOS update. Um, we'll see if we get a rich desktop here. Ooh, I think we will. I think we will. It's, that's a very good sign. And there you go, guys. You know, this is my login page. And that shows you how to update your BIOS using the Windows BIOS utility. Okay. Again, just a disclaimer. This is my own experience. It looks like it works fine. And you saw the date. Uh, we're, this is already about a week ago. I just had to make sure that the laptop is working properly and there's no issues. And one thing as well is that I've noticed that the on and off of the fan is no longer obvious, right? Of course, it will still do turn in on and off. But prior to this bias update, the on and off is so obvious that it's already annoying. And if that continues, it might ruin your, your fan at a minimum. Okay, so again, please be careful. Make sure that you have 60 to 90% battery power and your AC adapter is plugged into the wall. Okay, so here's another smash unbox. Please stay safe and see you again. Bye.